Hey, what's up everyone? Dragon here with Ashley. Doing another reaction, uh, trailer reaction. Sorry, I got a, it's been a long day, folks. Uh, this one's for Black Panther, the newest Marvel film. We got our first look at him in uh, Civil War. He's a pretty cool guy. Uh, admittedly, I don't know much about Black Panther, so it was kind of my introduction to the character. But I like what I saw, so I'm, uh, I'm very interested to see kind of this, uh, this, this very interesting uh, character, superhero. So without further ado, let's check out the trailer. Sex like a trailer. Um, again, not like a long trailer, but again, mostly just a lot of kind of. It's a teaser. Yeah, action shot, but it looked really cool. Uh, you know, I knew this obviously was going to take place in Africa and that, you know, it was going to, you know, be one of the things was they said, one of the, you know, a, a movie, a superhero movie that's really, you know, predominant. I think Andy Serkis and Martin Freeman are the only two white people. Yeah. Well, at least the only two that I saw in the trailer. Of like the main cast. Yeah. yeah. But it, it's really cool to see a lot of like kind of like uh, African imagery in the film because I've always said in terms of like mythology and lore like African is like you know is the oldest in the world you know what I mean so whenever we think of like myth and legend we always usually think of like European and even like the Far East but I'm like you never really see a lot of like with like the kind of the African aesthetic and I'm like well that's some of the oldest and more most interesting in the world so I love seeing a modern film a superhero film no less that it really has that takes place in Africa and really you know, looks and feels like it's there, you know what I mean? Yeah. Which makes sense if it takes place there. But no, I like I like the aesthetic. I uh, like all the armor and stuff too. It's all really nice. Yeah. Uh, no, his, his Black Panther, I forget, does it like enhance him or is he enhanced? Like he, I don't I, remember. I, I, I'm trying, again, I don't know much about the character, guys. Again, like I said, my knowledge. I think no. it was supposed to be like a, like a, a power, but I don't know if it's like I don't is think it, it's just a suit. I think it's like is it from him? Like again, you guys out there who obviously are, I'm sure, very familiar with the character and just Marvel I comics always, in general. Again, because he even said something about I don't know. I thought I I've always assumed well not always, but I, from like a Avengers, I assumed it was like an inherited power. Yeah, because it's like the, there's like been like a power. line of yeah. Black Panther. Like the Black Panther's like a guardian, like a protector. That's kind of what I thought it was. What so. I mean, you guys let us know. Is it is it his suit? Does he have like an Iron Man thing going on where the suit just kind yeah, of? I don't think it's just the suit. Or is it like him? I mean, obviously he has you know he knows how to fight, so it's not yeah. just like okay, he's not just some slob guy eating Cheetos and then he puts on the suit so he's whooping ass. Obviously he can handle himself, but is it the suit? enhancing his natural ability or is it kind of like a Steve Rogers thing where he himself is already a little bit more you know capable you know and the suit is more just kind of the aesthetic of it which I love the suit I love I love how the Black Panther I don't know I, I just dig it like mm -hmm. I think it's a cool design and again it's you know as a character uh in Marvel's at this point now where again like I said like with Doctor Strange where now they're can dig deep enough where like you know the general public knows about you know Captain America and Iron Man but you know 
these characters are like probably unless you really read Marvel comics, you probably kind of secondary. Yeah, not secondary in terms of importance, but, but in terms, in terms like of general of, public and yeah, what. Yeah. Uh, but, popularity. Yeah, but it's interesting. These are the characters I find way more interesting. I, mean, I think. I mean. Iron Man, Captain, I think they're cool, but I like these kinds of characters that have kind of more of a thing to them. I don't know. Yeah. I Again, I find characters like Black Panther and Doctor Strange a little bit more interesting because they themselves are a bit, seem a bit more unconventional, yeah. which I like. I like those. So I'm glad we're getting these kind of characters now. And I don't know. It just it looks good, but, you know, Marvel doesn't really disappoint. I mean, yeah. there's, I mean, there's certain Marvel movies I like more than others, obviously, but I don't think I've ever seen a Marvel movie where I was like, oh, that sucks. You know, <laughs> I usually always walk away feeling like I got my money's worth, and I feel that this one will be no different. Uh, it's going to be interesting seeing Andy Serkis without a... Like, uh -huh. I heard him something about his character. Did, did something happen to him where he looks different at some point? Uh, I can't remember if I'd read him. So you guys I who, heard So you guys who know the comics in and out, let us know. You know, Is does Andy, Sir, is Andy Serkis actually going to get to show his face for a while for the movie? He's going to say, do a non-mocap Yeah, or is that going to go away? And and, uh, and is the suit what makes the Black Panther the Black Panther? Or is there some other kind of power that isn't giving him you know, all these kind of enhanced abilities. Let us know, because again, I am curious. I'm, I, I dig the character. So, what did you guys think of this first teaser for Black Panther? Did you like it? Uh, did you like his portrayal in Civil War and therefore are excited, you know, for for his own movie? Were you not so hot on it and hoping that maybe the movie, you know, fixes things that maybe you didn't like? Yeah, either way, give us some of your thoughts. Let us know if you have not done so already. Please subscribe to our channel. We'll leave a link in the description section as always. And thank you guys for checking in. Give us some of your thoughts. Let us know. We'll try to jump in there and join in the conversation. So, we'll catch you on the next one. Peace. Peace.